Do you guys like her hat? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, I'll get a hat for her for this trip, and it's way too big. Yeah. But it's... hey, as long as it covers her face, then her head. This is a learning trip for sure for us. Uh, just trying to figure out what it takes to travel with this little one and camp and mm -hmm. do all that. One thing we're seeing already is that heat is going to be a challenge. Today it's like, it's mild. It's like, it's like in I the said, 70s. yeah, it's in the 70s. Yeah, but... so it feels great. I mean, it's, but tomorrow it's supposed to be warmer. So we're heading back tomorrow. So this is my first time cooking in this kitchen. Um, one of the things that I really like about it is the versatility of the space. So um, having our stove uh, be able to be put away and taken out like we do is really great because it frees up this counter space for other things when you're not using it. Hammock's all set up. Wonderful. All right, while you guys hang out, I'm gonna go for a bike ride, okay? Sounds good. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. Thank you. You got it. All right, guys, check it out. We are testing out a brand new e-bike today. Uh, this is the M20 by Engway. When I first laid my eyes on this thing, I was impressed, mainly with the, the style and design of it. It really looks like uh, a dirt bike or a motorcycle. You can see it's got the saddle instead of a normal bike seat. Of course, you've got the electric assist on this thing. It's got a 48 volt, a thousand watt powerful motor. Uh, but at the same time, it also has pedals. So you can pedal this thing like a bike or you can use that electric assist as much or as little as you want. It's got the fat knobby tires, which are gonna be great for either in dirt or mud or snow in the winter time. I really love that this version comes with this rack bag that allows you to uh, keep your tools or any other things with you while you're riding. That's gonna come in handy when I'm taking it out for longer rides. All right, let's fire this puppy up. I also want to give you a heads up that Engway is celebrating their ninth anniversary and providing 999 gifts to their customers with the Lucky Spin Wheel giveaway. When users sign up, they can play the game and have a chance to win, including spending only 90 cents to get an Engway e-bike, gift box, or other accessories. Also, they're providing customers up to $200 off when buying an e-bike. You can check out the promotion in the description below. I've got that linked down there for you. All right, we are on the trail. I'm making it up this hill, you guys. Cuddling on the lowest gear, but I'm making it. Oh, looks like we got a bit of a log in the trail here. Get this thing over it. <laughs> there we go. So we've topped out, and now we're on the flat trail to the overlook. Hard work is done. We're in a grove of pines. Pines are just the best. They're my favorite type of tree, just because the smell and just everything about them. They're nostalgic for me. And uh, anytime I get to be in the pines, I'm a happy guy.
I wish Riley, Ellie, and Olivia were here too. Um, unfortunately, we're giving Riley a little more time to heal after, uh, after the C-section. And, uh, you know, Olivia's so young. She'll have time once she uh, just gets a little older, maybe a couple more months. We'll start dragging her a little bit further out away from the cabin. All right, as much as I'd love to stay up here all day, who wouldn't? Better get back, check on the girls. But now it's time for the fun part, the downhill. guys man oh it looks like Olivia's asleep overall the ride was an absolute success this thing took a major beating we went over boulders we went over trees and, and mud and a little bit of ice and snow and it handled it like a champ. Uh, battery life hung in there. It's got like half a battery left. And I was using that electric assist the entire time. Um, I was not expecting to get up to the top of the bluff, but we did. And uh, yeah, I love this bike. Here are all the details for the promotion. They're also in the description of this video. And uh, I want to say thank you to Engwe for the bike and for sponsoring this video. You got it. Go with her, Ellie. Ellie's too loyal. She's gonna stay with me. There she goes. Let's go sneak up on Olivia. There she goes. <laughs> good job, Ellie. That's a good doggy. Yeah. There you go, Elle. Go, go, go. Yeah, there she goes. <laughs> good job, Elle. Man, you guys, what a blessing it is. You know, so many times I've gone camping and stuff alone or just Ellie and me, which I love too, you know, but uh, having the whole family out here is, this is the way it's supposed to be. Love this. It's pretty sweet, huh? Really fun. Yeah. Really fun. Such a good fun. addition to the cabin. Yes. Like, we it have may... to bring this with us always. For real. Rye's gonna walk down the little pathway here. Me, I think it's hammock time. Oh, check this out, you guys. Little baby monitor, so I can keep tabs on her. I'm telling you, technology has changed the baby game. <laughs> Did you see us walking down there? Yeah. She would, uh, she just doesn't go that far without you. I know, she's great. Like, she, she waits for you. She's good on a walk. Right out. Look at this little munchkin. Here we go. <laughs> We're, we're just gonna walk through the campground a little bit. She's a little fussy and I don't blame her. Girl just woke up from a nap. Yeah, she she's ate. like her mama in that <laughs> way. Like I'm very grumpy when I wake up from naps and I'm not a morning person. And I think she takes after me in that way. All 
right, Olivia. Here we go. Oh. Oh, is that oh. nice, Olivia? Oh, wet your hair. Is that nice? Yeah, nice. And Daddy gets some too. Oh, to cool off. All right, now my turn. Your turn? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, crank that. <laughs> there you go. This is a good workout. It is. Oh, it's so cold. Oh. Hi, my sweet. Look at her hair, you guys. Look how sweet. Oh, we're obsessed with her. We love her so much. We do. She is such a joy in our lives and just very grateful for her answered prayer we love her right <laughs> right <laughs> no are you getting bored <laughs> <laughs> she awake? She's kind of awake. Good What'd you think of the uh the bed? Oh my gosh, it was so comfy. It was so great. I slept yeah, I slept it was incredible. Well good morning. <laughs> yeah. We had a little interesting evening. Nothing crazy. Well, I guess this was a little crazy, but um, basically what ended up happening was after our walk, we came in and we, we saw that it was 80 degrees. It was only supposed to be like 70. And uh, so what we did was we drove into town, which is only 10 minutes away, which is actually really convenient. Um, and we had dinner there. And so we got Olivia and some air conditioning. Then when we came back, I was like, oh, I'm gonna make a fire. And I stepped on one of our pieces of, of wood that I collected and the thing swung up and like cut my eye. Well, it didn't get my eye, it got right under my eye. Thank God. Um, and, you know, after that I was just like, all right, it, it's time to just call it a day. <laughs> But despite all of that, there were a couple magical moments, one of which was at like 3 a.m. I came out here and rocked Olivia back to sleep and I was just listening to all the sounds and Ellie was out here and it was just, it was incredible. And that's what it's all about. All right, let's make some coffee. <laughs> she loves having her diapers made. Oh uh, yeah, she, she just loves it. Something I want to just like touch on really quickly while I'm thinking about it is like, is what the idea behind tiny cabin life is. It's, it's for people like us, um, maybe like you who want to experience this lifestyle, but maybe you don't own land or you aren't able to just like rent Airbnbs and things like that all the time. And maybe you're, you're stuck in the city or in suburbia, um, the whole idea of, of this channel, this lifestyle came from, um, just my thought that like, that shouldn't hold you back. We're fortunate enough to have my parents land close to us with that A-frame, but like when we were living in California together, we didn't have any of that. And so we had to like go to places like this and set up a tent and now we have the cabin and it's just uh 
it's wonderful. It's why public land exists to give everyday folks like us a chance to experience these un unbelievably beautiful and, and wild places and a lifestyle that we might not be able to afford otherwise. Gonna take a short little spin around the campground here. Just a little joy cruise. Then come back and whip up some breakfast burritos. Just can't get enough of this thing. Ellie, come on! Yeah! Look at this dog. All right, Al, getting some exercise. Good job. If I've said it once, I'll say it again. This is the life. Look how beautiful this is with the pines. Holy cow. And it looks like we have another hiking trail off this way. Oh man. I wonder where that one leads. You guys, this is incredible back here. Come on out. Let's get back. It's time for breakfast. Good job, Al. That was a good run. Tortillas, onion, and chicken. for this day. Um, it's beautiful out here and for this food. Amen. Amen. about time to get out of here. Olivia's eaten. Had a blowout. <laughs> yeah, had a blowout. She's chilling now. Temperature's getting a little warm, so. No time to pack out. Up. So, what do you think? I think it was a success. First trip with baby Olivia. Uh, first trip with Travel Cabin 2.0. I want to thank Engway for the M20 bike as well as sponsoring this video. And you guys, if you want to check one of these out, please look at the promotion. I have all the details in the description of this video. The thing's sick. Like, it's so fun. <laughs> I, had, I had an absolute <laughs> blast with it. So, uh, I definitely recommend it. But with that, Time to get out of here. <laughs> we'll see you guys on the next one. Whew. In case any of you guys were wondering how I film this stuff.
set up the camera, ride by, then I hike back and get the camera. It's not easy, but it's worth it. It turns out really great.